superstitious like that. <laughs> Begin! <laughs> Sexy! Fluorescent! Mexy bit of shoulder! Howdy Super Hall Sunday world and welcome back to the Super Hall Sunday spot. Today we are doing literally something that I am so, 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 so excited for and I've been having to wait to unbox these because I know you guys love a good unboxing and try on. So I've got two ginormous, I've got two of these boxes from, you'll know by the title and the thumbnail, Misguided! I am so, so, so incredibly grateful and excited to be working with Misguided on this video. And yes, like what the hell? I can't believe it. Everyone just... <laughs> yeah, I don't know what that noise was. But yes, I am working with Scarlet on this video and I'm so excited to share with you guys their new in pieces. I think I've said the fact that I'm excited probably about five times and we are like a minute into this. So we're doing good so far. But that does mean that I have a discount code for you all. So it is Misha20 and it's valid from the 17th of September until the 30th. So it isn't that long. So guys, if you want anything from this guided site or the new in 2018 autumn pieces that I'm going to be unboxing, then you need to jump on that because I feel like my whole family, after I film this video, are going to be on the website. Like, <laughs> I love that one, I love that one. Yes, so Misguided, if you've never heard of it before, then you must be living under a rock. But just in case, they are a very incredibly reasonably priced brand on the interweb. And they have a few, like, stands in stalls. And I have to say, my favourite is the one in Birmingham Selfridges. I love the Misguided store in there. Okay, yes, I'm so excited. Okay, Misha, stop saying the fact that you're excited. Let's open up these bad boys. They've been in my house since Friday or Thursday. Thursday. Today is Monday. Talk about the self-restraint right now. And if you think that my hair um, looks like gelled back wet look, no, no, don't worry. That's just grease. Just grease. No gel, no hairspray, nothing. Yeah. I'm gonna go and have a bath after this, don't worry. Anyway, so yes, let's get a wiggle on. I have not shopped on Misguided in a hot minute. I don't know why, I just kind of haven't. And I'm like, Misha, you need to get in on that stuff. So that's why I'm bringing to you guys a Misguided haul. Let's get along with it. I just wanna open it. Let's just rip it open, people. It's all like more autumnal and wintry pieces. This is probably gonna be the most wintry haul I've done so far this September. Oh, oh, oh. You know you've ordered way too much when it comes in boxes rather than their bags. Like that's impressively bad. So I've accidentally matched my outfit to the first coat that I'm pulling out, which is, ready for it? So exciting! <laughs> so this is the oversized board zip through jacket, and this is in a size UK six, and it's in the most beautiful emerald green. I know these jackets are everywhere, the ones that look like teddy bears, and I had to get involved! Oh my gosh, it's literally a... What's that one? What's the green monster? Not monster. The one that looks like an alligator slash a crocodile. Barney! Barney! I'm going to look like Barney, guys. I'm going to actually look like Barney. Oh my god, I can't wait to look like Barney. Okay, I need to stop saying OMG. 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 Well, isn't this blooming... Look at that colour. Oh, I give myself a nice chin when I do that. Look at that camera. Just look. I look like a little Michelin man, but I really like that with coats. Like, the fluffier, the better. And it actually has pockets, which 
you know me i love me a good pocket if things don't have pockets it does quite annoy me and if they have fake pockets that's like double the annoyance because it's like why would you have a fake pocket just have a real pocket anyway this does have pockets you can obviously wear it undone if you're like cool and vibey or how i'm gonna wear it when it's cold it's all done up and i really like the fact it's got this little collar how cute i love the color oh i kind of look like a little floating head in a big coat but i don't really mind and then lengthwise it's like the perfect length that like it would cover your bum a little bit if you were wearing something like leggings and you didn't want your butt cheeks out now apparently i got some shoes i can't recall what shoes these were but oh yes i can okay these boots were giving me such louis vibes that i was like i need some camely colored shoes in my life so can we see they've got like this really cool velcro strap which takes me back to school when you said velcro shoes then they've got these laces so they're kind of like a louis slash timberland style boot they've got a nice thick chunky sole so if you were to go somewhere adventurous you'd be good but if you're just me and you wear the thick chunky sole for fashion reasons then you do you boo um because i'm not really the adventurous type i won't lie to you all but no these are luscious it's like kind of having a heel without having a heel because it's practical i love the color yes 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 they don't smell which is brill oh my god i cannot wait to wear these i love camel come like autumn winter i think it's one of my favorite colors camel and gray but mum's really into green recently, so she is going to be all about that coat. Next up, we have another one of Misha's favourite colours. The lighting is really dark. I'm very sorry, it's a bit dark outside. I might try and open the window and see if that... Not literally open it, but I realise the blind isn't all the way down. Definitely meant up rather than down. Bless my soul. Anyway, okay, yes. So we all know that I love red. I think red is probably one of the best colors of the color spectrum because everyone looks good in red i don't know how many times i have to say that but everyone does so o m to the g i'm in love oh my god i'm actually in love oh my gosh it even has like a high neck if you wanted to if you're really cold <gasps> that's real oh my gosh 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 let's get this bad boy on Oh my gosh so this is the faux fur ultimate aviator because of course all these pieces are faux fur and pleather so don't go worrying peeps i didn't used to like aviators but now i do oh my god look at that collar look at that collar when i'm cold this is literally me in winter this is a mood this is winter misha 2k18 or oh, slash 2019 Okay, so how you can wear it a bit more funky. Oh my goodness, this is beautiful. The quality of that. And I don't know if you guys can tell. This bit is like a faux suede pleather. And then this bit, this bit and this bit is a faux fur. And it's like a very flat faux fur. So it kind of reminds me of a carpet, but in a really good way. Oh, just look how beautiful this is. Oh my gosh. When you guys are watching this, I'm actually down in Cornwall. And I wanted to make sure that I filmed this video before I went. Because A, I want to edit it on the four and a half hour journey down there. And B, I wanted to wear some of these pieces whilst I'm there. And I'm not sure which coat to take. Is it bad if I take all of them? Should I take every item from this haul? It will probably happen, let's not lie. I love this colour of red. It's such a beautiful, bright red. Oh, okay. Every time I do that, I'm scared I'm gonna pop something out, but I've got nothing to pop, so don't worry, people. Oh, okay, I bought another coat. I may have picked another blooming coat, but it's a black coat, and I don't really own any black coats. So, I'm excused. <gasps> oh my gosh! Okay, now I'll see to tally how many times I say, oh my gosh, or oh my god, because it's just too many. Oh, it's got a nice big button. <gasps> no! 
No, guys, it has a hood. I'm gonna look like Raven from, you know, the program. You know, the guy that looked like a, well, see, he didn't look like a Raven. He was just the, the presenter on Raven. I'm gonna look like him. Cannot wait. Okay, this is the probably, <gasps> What does he say in Raven? I might have to Google it so I can find out. Let's pretend I've got a stick. Um, I'll just use a setting spray. Let the challenge begin! <laughs> Wait, no, I've got the hood. Let the challenge begin! <laughs> oh my god, I'm in love with this coat. <gasps> I actually think this is my favourite and it's black. It's quite long. Let me try and... I'm just gonna pull down the camera. Oh, but now my tripod's in the way. It's like quite a lengthy coat. So it comes down to my knees, which I do think is good to have some coats that are longer because sometimes it's just so damn cold. That you need a full length coat. And just, oh my God, I'm in love. This is actually my favorite coat and it's black. Who would have thought? I love this. It's like a fully teddy bear fleece situation mum is gonna be so gel and your mum are just gonna steal all of these coats I can tell that is the really good thing about coats though like a they match so many people's different styles and B you can literally share them because sizes normally can fit multiple people so yeah I do feel like coats are a good investment people I've got another pair of shoes apparently oh yes one does remember now we all know i'm hugely into these like retro style trainers um because they're just everywhere at the moment and i thought i'd try out misguided ones so they are these like thick oh it's really hard because the camera kind of whites them out um but they've got this thick sole um which does give you a bit of a heel so if you're a short lady then Bob's your uncle, and then they've just got the laces up the front, and I got them in a size 7, because I always find that trainers like this come up a little bit small, so I would always suggest, if you're going for this big, chunky style, to size up a size, because I've learnt the hard way, people, but no, these are so nice, okay, let's all make a bet down below how long these stay white for, because I bet about an hour, just being realistic. Oh, yeah, I've already got makeup on them. <laughs> so what was that? 20 seconds? Probably not even that. But no, they're so nice. They're such nice quality. I don't think I've actually ever owned a pair of trainers from Misguided. So that's exciting. That is one box down and one to go. Just to prove that there is another huge box. Yeah, okay. I have a feeling that that was my last coat. But I think I may have lied. I think we need to just call this a coat haul. Um, but if they do something in baby pink, I just can't say no. I just I just can't. Now, I remember with this one that it's actually a petite jacket. And I'm not particularly, like, I don't particularly shop in the petite section. So I thought if I was going to get a petite item, I would size up. And that's what I would suggest. If you really like something in the petite section, and it doesn't matter if it's a little bit shorter, because I know the petite sections are for girls. I think it's like under 5'4", five, 5'3". Five, um, and I'm 5'5", five, 5'5 five, five, five and a half. But if I size up and it's a coat, I don't really mind if it's a bit more cropped. <gasps> Look at that colour. Oh, and it has little poppers on the sleeves. Oh my gosh, I love this. So I think this is the exact same as the green one. As far as I can tell, if you like something, buy it in every colour. That's my words of wisdom for today. This is such a nice colour. It's a very nice twist on pink because it's actually more of like a camely soft pink and it perfectly matches my nails yes okay i love this and as you can see it's a petite but it fits me fine i just sized up to an eight we're all good oh now we move on to jumpers so first up we have another nude piece that would go perfectly with the jacket i can already tell i'm gonna have to repack my entire suitcase for St. Ives because I've changed my mind on what I want to take thanks to Misguided. Oh, oh, 
Oh, okay, so I got this one in a UK 8 as well because I like some of my jumpers to be a bit a little more baggy. I could wear it off the shoulder, you know, get a sexy bit of shoulder out for the no one. Anyway, yeah, it's in this beautiful pink, exactly the same pretty much as the jacket. And it's like a cropped one with a wide neck. It's got this cable knit finish. Let's pop this bad boy on and I can take off this revealing top. O, M to the G. I am in love. Does this not give you like winter slash Scottish vibes? Clueless, nerdy, but like good nerd. Like you know how like nerd fashion is now like a good thing i don't even get what nerd fashion is but i feel like that is a thing let me know down below what you think but i am digging on this as we can see i'm quite pale right now that's what happens in winter misha can't be bothered to fake tan because the amount of her that is out is her shoulder her ankles and her hands and that's not worth it but no this has got such a nice fit obviously you don't have to wear it with the one shoulder you can just wear it like that and it's got like a drop shoulder sleeve which i just think adds to like the slouchy look i think this looks so nice it's also the sort of jumper that you could tuck in because it's got quite a thin bit here obviously it doesn't go with this skirt but if I had a skirt that it did go with, I could tuck it in and it wouldn't make me look really bulky because I know we all hate when we want to tuck something in and it just makes us look about 20,000 sizes bigger than we are because we don't need that. Nada. Nada. Another jumper! I feel like they packaged this very, very well. They put like all the jackets at the top, then the jumpers, and then eventually... We'll get to clothes. Well, these are clothes, but you know what I mean. Um, okay, so we all know that Misha has this obsession with lilac. So we put lilac, grey, and pink together in a fluorescent pink. I'm, I'm just, I'm a happy gal. So I got this one in a UK six, and I'm glad I did because I think it said already on it that it was an oversized fit. Yes, this is the colour block striped oversized jumper, and is that not beautiful i feel like i'm gonna need to get myself some more like jogging bottoms because i feel like i've got too many jumpers now and not enough bottoms maybe i just go out in the jumpers no bottoms you never know i might get a few stairs but each to their own why does everything get stuck to me okay so the fabulous thing about these sort of jumpers is we all know that typically i do have quite a girly style and i don't like jumpers that you couldn't wear pretty but you could wear these jumpers with like a little skirt or a little dress. You could make them your style if you're not typically a jumper gal. Because look at this. This one is definitely more of an oversized fit. And it's got these beautiful balloon sleeves. But I really enjoy a balloon sleeve. I wouldn't enjoy a balloon ride. Because I don't really like the idea of being flown into the air. Being held up by a bit of wind and a fire. But the sleeve type, my friend. But yeah, this is just like a really comfy, cosy piece that I could eat as much roast dinners as I wanted to and the world would be a happy place because that is probably my personal highlight about winter. Christmas, roast dinners, food, roast dinners, more food, more Christmas. And more food? Probably. We can tell what floats my boat. But no, all these knitwears are a really nice knit. They're not too thick that they're uncomfortable, but they're not too thin that you would freeze your nippleage off. So, let's continue on with Do another jumper! Okay, I seem to have gone for all different styles with these jumpers, which is really good because I'm just showing you guys the broad spectrum that Miss Guided has to offer. Now, this one it gives me American football jersey vibes. And I really need to stop saying the phrase vibes because every time I say it when I look back in editing, I cringe at myself. But can we think of another word that I can use instead of vibes? It gives me the feels. That sounds wrong. So this is in the UK 6 and it is a V-neck colour block cable jumper. So it's another cable net. Can people actually also comment down below whether they like me mentioning sizes? Because I've never really done it because I feel like people just don't like it because they just, I don't know, I feel like people get hate for saying sizes, um, which I don't really want. But then people comment saying, could you let us know what sizes you get? So... 
let me know which I should do. Yeah, help a gal out. Okay, I think I found my fave. And I know I've pretty said that about every single item, but look at it. Like, my elbows are in a stripe of orange. My neckline has got a stripe of orange. I can do it a one shoulder. I can do it a normal. <gasps> I think this is my favourite. I feel like I'm part of the football team. Or is it rug... I feel like in America they call football rugby and rugby football. Soccer? I don't know. But... <gasps> That's me running with a football... Rugby ball, who knows, who knows, soccer ball. I'm just gonna give up and move on to the next item. I'm pretty sure we have one last jumper. And Misha, do you realize that you've got the exact same jumper? I can't be the only one that does that. Oh, okay. So this is the same shape as the grey one that I had on before. So I basically got two different styles in this shape and then two different styles in this shape. But it's <laughs> very similar to the one I have on but enough of a difference that you need both in your life, people. What can I say? What would be the whole with that mama grinds? Shock. She's popping in. She can't help herself. Yeah, I'm having an ugly day today. I'm not entering in front of the camera. You have to. If you're coming no, in voice, you I'm have not. to come in camera. I absolutely... Are you ready to see this coat on? Oh, Are you ready? goodness. Oh, I like this one. I really, really like it. These are so cosy. Like, oh my gosh. I'm just having a look at what else is in there, but she can't see. She's a nightmare. She's an absolute nightmare. And of course, oh, she's in a onesie. Beautiful. What are you unpackaging? But no, oh, I love Oh, I'm excited for what's next. Oi! So, yes, these sleeves are nice and long, which I appreciate in the winter because I don't want my fingers and my hands getting cold. So when I'm sat there, I can do that. Oh my goodness, this is exciting stuff. Well, do you want to... I don't... No, 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 no. Here's your phone. Okay. There. Oh my gosh, I remember this! This is far too cool for me, but I thought, you know, I'm going to try it. Right, hold on. I've got a question for Misha. Camera off. <gasps> Misha, listen, I could walk so that I leave you with a car and then you drive up, but I need to know in advance. So then you can come at 1.30 when I'm finished. But obviously there's a lot of stuff in the suitcase. Guys, I seem to think I'm a racer boy, okay, and I really so like it. I'm shocked. I would have never had you pick this. I up. thought I'd try out some different pieces, and it's waterproof, that so is... it's practical. But is this not so cool? I feel like we're reinventing raincoats and making mm. them cool. I can see Madison wearing this. Yeah, this but... is very Madison, isn't it, Madison? If you're watching this, hi. <laughs> but no, oh my god, I like it. I think it's really cool. I don't know how I'm going to style it. I don't know how I'm going to make it Misha. But stay tuned on my Instagram, at Misha underscore Grimes, to find out. Maybe I'll even get mum in it. No, and maybe you see Papa Grimes in it. It does look like it would be Papa Grimes. It's, but I like this. You know, I'm testing out different styles, people. It's a new season. I get my head stuck. Okay, my head's stuck. Oh, okay, that's not just me. Misha, you oh, are... She has already managed to put her makeup all over a jumper. What was wrong with this girl? Whoopsies. I got another coat! That's the one I was excited about. How many coats did I pick up? How many coats have we done so far? Four? Well, do you cast Four? that as a coat? That's okay. Four. That's probably a coat as well. Five. We're on the sixth coat. Sixth coat. Oh my oh. God, it's the raven coat, but in maroon. Is it the same as the black one? It's the same as the black one! Oh my god, she's screeching like a maniac. I'm just she? too excited. Oh my god, that colour explosion with everything that you've got. Yeah, underneath. ignore what I've got on a... Oh, oh my god. Okay, no, goodness. this is my favourite. Oh my god, look. Can we all take a moment? Buttons? Has it got buttons? Or yeah, it has undone? a button here. Oh, very... Oh, that's so adorable. Okay, I'm in heaven. I'm loving life. I could just... I could just end now and be happy. Misha! The hall. Oh, oh, I thought you were talking about the hall. I thought she wanted to be buried in this coat. Oh my god, I would so be buried in this coat. Misha! Note to self. <laughs> joking, joking. No. Misha, anyway. spit over your shoulder. We're superstitious like that. Puh. Puh. Uh -huh. Puh. Explain. I just what got we it do. on the camera. Sorry. No. So basically, me and Mum are always really scared of. Uh, it's not even. Okay, it's not I'm even I'm scared. It's just a habit now that every time I say something, I'm like, touch wood. 
even though it's not wood and I touch my head, even though I know that's not wood and I spit over my shoulder. Because the saying is, throw salt over your left shoulder, but we could never remember which one was, if it was left or right that we need to do it to. And we never have salt with us. So we turn it into spit over both shoulders. Yeah, I don't know why. I got another jumper. <laughs> I am fully, fully stacked up with jumpers and coats until blooming it next winter, thanks to Misguided. I like this one. Oh, this is more of a, oh yeah, it says brushed cropped. And I do get that. It's more like a brushed soft fabric. We've got a little, little turtleneck going on. Oh my gosh, I love these. And I do really appreciate the fact that these are cropped so I can wear them with high-waisted things and it looks nice. Now I'm gonna take off all these layers, pop this bad boy on. They've done it again. They've done it again. It's such a nice shape. And I like how although they're cropped. Bye ambulance. Oh, actually it's a police car. You go Glen Coco. You go save lives, you do it, you, you, you do it. Okay, I don't know what, who I think I am. But yes, again, more balloon sleeves, my favorite thing in the wintry months. And yeah, they're cropped, but they're not skin tight. So it kind of sits just over. And then if you wear something that's skinny, like fitted, it makes your waist look smaller. Little hack for you all. I love the colors, such beautiful autumnal colors. Most bougiest sunglasses. I think I've ever seen. We all know that Misha likes an obnoxious pair of sunglasses and these are no different. Um, and I know you're probably thinking, Misha, we're in September, reaching the end of September. Why are you getting sunglasses? Well, people, the sun sometimes shines in the wintry months and these glasses, oh, do I look like an idiot in them? Do I look like I'm a spaceship owner? Do I look like I'm from outer space? There's my ring light in them. Or do they look cool? I don't know. What do we think? I quite like them. They're very different. They've got like this little bit here. But with like a big furry coat and sunglasses, I just think that looks bougie. Bougie, all aboard the bougie bus. <laughs> that sounds funny. It's gonna be no surprise that the last few pieces that I picked up, well, two of them are T-shirt dresses. Oh, oh look, I get to peel it. <gasps> That's so fun. Okay, so if you could describe Misha in one word and you were gonna be nice about this word, what would it be? Comment down below. Ready? Oh, you can't even read that. <laughs> princess! I like to think I'm a little bit of a princess, but in a good way, not in a bad way, you know? good to have high standards um, and this is just a black and white striped t-shirt dress with the princess embellishment screen print I'm not sure what you want to call it this is in a UK 6 but these are all oversized so I wouldn't suggest sizing up if anything I'd suggest sizing down just so it's not like completely drowning you. But you could always wear this as a belt if you felt like it was too big. But let's try this bad boy on. I'm a huge fan of t-shirt dresses, we know that. Let's do this. Am I the only one getting fresh Prince of Bel-Air vibes? <laughs> Slash, I've escaped from prison, but it's so comfy. Like, literally on a comfort level of zero to 100, this is like 99.9% .9 reoccurring. I think it looks really cool. And I, you, it's hard to show you my leg, but they are there. And we see, you could like belt it and make it a bit shorter, but I do think this would look really, really sexy with red, pardon me, red knee-high boots just to give it a little bit more of like a sexy vibe, a sexy, sexy vibe. Oh my gosh, no, I think this is really cool. But yeah, I do kind of look like I've escaped prison. Lol. At least I've got my outfit ready for when they come and arrest me for buying too many clothes or owning too many fluffy coats from Misguided. Okay. One more t-shirt dress because I seem to be getting things in numbers in this haul. And this one is also black, but 
It's in more of like a cottony normal t-shirt fabric. It has two lemons on the front. Those are lemons, aren't they? Yes. And on it, it says twisted. So that's probably more of the word you used to describe me. <laughs> Hopefully not, but you never know. So yeah, it's just a really comfy black oversized t-shirt dress that says twisted on it. Twist it. Pull it. Sing it. Twist it. Pull it. Twirl it. Bop it. Am I the only one that remembers that? Bop it. I remember my sister's high school was like 74 and the most I could get was like 30 because I was awful at it. I'm getting boyfriends, bed shirt, feels, vibes, but I don't have a boyfriend to steal his tops, so I'm just gonna wear them from Misguided. So you can roll up the sleeves if you want more of a cool chick look, because you know, me being the professional cool chick, I would know how it works. But can we see, they give a different look. Um, so yeah, this is just like a plain black one. These are literally so comfy. They're the sort of thing I would sleep in and then go out in without changing because I'm gross. <laughs> but they're comfy. Okay, final item, I think. So final item is probably what you guys would assume is the most Misha item. And this is in a UK six and it is the printed long sleeved utility jumpsuit. So there's a lot going on with this item, just to pre-warn you, but ooh, that fabric looks exciting expensive so it is a navy silky boiler suit it has button down at the top with a collar and then it has a little drawstring oh is it a drawstring oh no it's a fake drawstring a pretend drawstring waistband but you can bow that little bit there so let's finish off with some pantaloons let's get this bad boy on okay hello yes Here's Misha in her very snazzy boiler suit. Now, me being me, I didn't do up the buttons, but you could if you wanted to. Now, I'm surrounded by <laughs> packaging, so I'm slipping on everything, but this is so nice. I don't know if you could particularly wear this in, like, winter, winter, but I do think this could look really nice with, like, army boots, a little gilet, it's sort of like an autumnal piece. And I just think it's really snazzy. You could also then dress it up with heels and make it evening wear appropriate and go clubbing in it or go out for a dinner. I just like it. It's kind of giving me Versace vibes of all this print going on. I think it looks mega expensive and it is so comfortable. You could also belt it if you wanted to, but you know, the world's your oyster people. Okay, so let's wrap up this haul. whoop de doo So this has been my misguided haul. I hope you guys have all enjoyed. I most certainly have, and the wait to open the boxes was worth it, a million percent. I'm very sorry if you now feel the need to go out and buy about six coats. I deeply apologize. It's not my fault. But if you do do that, then don't forget to use my code MISHA20 to save 20% off. And if there's anything else on the website that you want to pick up, then go and grab that. Yes. Anyway, so I'm going to love you guys and leave you. Make sure to do a like and subscribe. If you've never seen my face before, then hi, I'm Misha Grimes. I upload four times weekly fashion, lifestyle, crazy, fun, bit of beauty based videos and I hope you love this video. So anyway, I'm gonna love you and leave you. Toodle Pip, make sure to follow me and Misguided on Instagram and I will see you all next time. Bye bye peeps, see ya, Mwah. love you.